Whew. Buongiorno, burial stick here. Boy, it's humid today. It's like sitting in a sauna. What are we going to be up to? Well, we're going to be going inside to do a recipe today. You might remember uh, a few weeks ago we had the vote for the return meal for Mrs. Stick. And the winner was the uh, citrus spiked sea bass, which of course is a barbecue recipe. Well, I ain't got enough lights to film preparation of that at night. And when the temperature is 40 degrees with near enough 100% humidity, I'm certainly not going to be lighting the barbecue during the day. So Mrs. Stick came up with a really, really good idea. What Mrs. Stick suggested, didn't she, Daisy? You heard her yourself. She said, why don't you cook the other three recipes, didn't she, Ted? She said that, sorry, the other two recipes indoors. And then you can do those as vlogs and launch them from time to time. So that's what we're going to do starting today. Daisy May's looking for lizards, aren't you, Daisy? So the question is, of course, which recipe are we going to do? Now, I think my favourite one was probably the baked sea bass with fennel. Fennel and fish always go together very nicely, of course. So, uh, along with Mrs. Stick, I think we've agreed today to go indoors and cook the uh, baked sea bass with a fennel, a very, very easy recipe. If you look back several posts on the Facebook page at Vario Stick, you will find all the ingredients and the methods for cooking uh, these particular things. But to be honest, this one is so simple. Uh, you hardly need to write it down. You just need a few ingredients, about 30 minutes in the oven, and away you go. Just my kind of recipe. So, gone into the kitchen. Um, these are the ingredients for the baked sea bass with fennel. It just couldn't be easy, this recipe. It's just as easy as making baked beans on toast. We've obviously got the sea bass. I've washed that. It's been filleted. We've got a handful of black olives. These have been pitted. A lemon, a small uh, fennel bulb, and some olive oil. And apart from some seasoning, that is it. It could not be simpler. So we've sliced the lemon fairly thin. Doing the same with the uh, fennel. Fairly thin slices, really. Doesn't have to be too, uh, too exact. Some of this is going inside the fish uh, and the rest of it is going to go in the uh, dish that uh, goes inside the oven. So we're going to put that together now with the fish, the black olives, a little bit of seasoning and put the whole thing in the oven. Yum yum. Okay, just about the final step now. Uh, with the oven's on, it's uh, at 200 degrees. Now I've got a fan assisted oven so you're going to have to make some adjustments yourself depending on what kind of oven you've got but I've got an electric fan assisted oven and it's set at 200 degrees. What we need to do now is get some fennel lemons uh, inside the um, sea bass. As you see it's been properly um, gutted or we're going to just put a little bit of fennel in there, one or two slices of lemon, doesn't have to be uh, particularly neat and tidy. And put that on the in our baking tray. The rest of the fennel I'm going to just scatter around. This is really simple cookery. I wish all cookery was this easy. Um, again a few slices of lemon perhaps on the fish under the fish itself. Some fennel under there. So it kind of sits on that bed really. Of a mixture of fennel and lemons and around and about we're going to scatter a few black olives which will add their distinctive flavour to this uh, wonderful Mediterranean dish. Baked sea bass with fennel, lemon and a few black olives. I'm going to season this now uh, and get it ready to go in the oven. Uh, about a teaspoon, a tablespoonful of olive oil just to stop it sticking uh, and that's just about it. It's as simple as that. So that's it. There we have it. That's going to go in the oven now. And we're going to set it to the timer for around about 30 minutes. But again, that depends on your oven. Uh, the recipe suggests that uh, this should be given about 30 minutes and the skin should be 
but slightly brown, just a little bit tinged in places. I'm really looking forward to this coming out. Okay, so uh, it's now out of the oven. Baked sea bass with fennel, slightly crispy on the outside. Mm. Ooh. That looks lovely. What do you think, Mrs. Stick? Mm. That smells like. Mm. I think fennel and fish go together quite nice, don't they? Mm. And the lemon, of course, as well. Yeah. That's not onion. That's uh, that's fennel, if you're wondering. <laughs> They're nice. Mm. A few bones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you get that with fish. So as a recipe then, what would you give it out of five? Out of five? Yes. Oh, definitely five. Five? Mm. You would like to eat that again? Definitely. Is that an evening meal or a lunchtime thing? Oh, either. Either. It's just lovely. If you mm. like fish, you like oh, this. Yes. Definitely. So, from uh, baked sea bass with fennel and Mrs. Stick, <laughs> This is Vario Stick saying, Ciao, ciao for now. <laughs>